am Rick Olson, and I'm the president of Olson Visual. Olson Visual is a 64-year-old company that has its history in the Olson family. My father, Bob Olson, started. Back then, he just did wet processing with black and white photo paper. Three kids eventually got in the business, and we started getting processors to do resin-coated paper. We began with museums, photographers, movie stars, anybody could come in. My brothers and I learned how to deal with all kinds of people on all different levels. As the digital format came into being, larger and larger format machines were available. And eventually we were able to purchase a five meter machine and started doing large banners. Ocean Visual is a uh, creative partner. Uh, we do a lot of design build for a lot of studios, museums, uh, high-end retail. We also do a lot of fine art uh, for clients. We create graphic large format visual displays to expand a company's brand in more ways than just through your standardized banner old school print process. Today we're the proud owner of a Durst 512. It's what I believe the top roll-to-roll -roll printer, UV printer in the world. And we're so excited about it. We realize the capacity it's going to bring us is helping all our processes from the creative element of design and just the production. On the row 512R, we're predominantly running textile, both transmissive and reflective. Certain features of the 512 will allow us for better control when running textiles that might have higher or lower elasticity. We love the Samba fabric with burger. The Samba fabric is the top seller for burger for the last five years, focused primarily on the UV printers across the US and Europe. The Samba fabric is used for a wide variety of applications, however it's mostly used for silicone edge graphics that are front lit, but its biggest application is for backlits. We're so excited that five meters is going to come. We've tested some, but the regular supply is going to start, and I know that's going to open the floodgates. We're going to see a growth in the trade show world. From the humble beginnings of processing by hand in tanks of chemicals to working with the super high-tech machines, it's a different world. The amount of pressure on our uh, on our production schedule here has been opened up considering the consistency, speed, and quality we are now producing on our 512R and our 320R. It has really reduced the amount of pressure we felt from a production standpoint. On the row 512R, we're experiencing twice the speed and twice the quality, considering the 12 picoliter and variable dot option on that print head. I'm having more fun than I've ever had in this business, and I think that it shows in everybody that works here. They can do more, they get more satisfaction by seeing a 16 foot by 100 foot graphic go up at an event, and backlighting where the color just jumps out at you. It's, it's new stuff that is bringing us to new heights. We're going into a motion virtual display era. And what that means is creating displays, incorporating our core business of printed graphics with movement elements and different types of materials and technologies that will really elevate and uh, sophisticate those end results for the client. One thing we pride ourselves here at Olsen on is the consistency and quality of our product. The Durst Row 512R has just added to our tools. It's just a great asset to allow us to reach that quality and consistency that we're known for here at Olsen Visual. We're gonna take those technologies and we're gonna supplement it with LED walls and flat screen arrays and projection and all that technology is all merging and I think Olson Visual is in a unique place. T3 is the building block for these structures and we were introduced a few years ago and it's become a mainstay that we can design any kind of structure. We can make circular, we can make them super tall, long, all that and it all packs up into either road cases or bags that I know it's gonna change the event and trade show industry. I've worked in the business 45 years and I'm looking forward to the, the next 15. <laughs>